Hello everybody. Uh, just wanted to guys show you guys a little bit of what we're doing today. We are cutting trees. Uh, probably 16 plus all day today. We've already about midday already. It's hot. We're probably already in the hundreds. Uh, it's running like a, a monkey without any lotion. <laughs> Anyways, uh, just to kind of give you an idea. Uh, we're on the 518. Uh, I'm kind of just running that one around with me today because I have the fire extinguishers and in there, shovels, all that great stuff. Uh, trees that are marked are trees that are going to stay. Those are pretty trees. Look at that. That's a big baby. All of those ones. Uh, this is what we're cutting with. Brand new. Uh, 372 XP standard yeah, got a kickback chain on it kind of sucky but nonetheless it does the job once I use that one up that's the one that came with the saw so once we use that one up we'll go ahead and uh, start start uh, with the uh, chisel chains but anyways, kind of give you an idea, I wanted to go take a look at the Feller Buncher, they're operating the processor today, it's a small little processor, but, you know, we're going to come in, drive that one, we're going to go back over and start into the beginning again, because we already got all these trees here, herring that we're going to throw, herring that's got to be thinned out, this is a thinning operation is what it is reason for them throwing these bigger trees is because they've got some sort of disease or uh, top is flat or there's just something wrong with it bug beetle ants there's always a good nice little thing to do with them and then oh I gotta go get my gas but yeah anyhow that's what we're doing today. We're going to go and look at the feller buncher here in a bit and see what we can look at. Not too sure if, uh, uh what else we're going to do. We'll just throw big trees. Big pretty ones. There's one right there. Look. That's what you call money maker over here. Uh, and look at that. My hand is, eh, it's a pretty decent size. I don't know if you can see that. It's actually pretty cool. This one is a big tree, but this is what I'm talking about when I say diseased or or uh, got something wrong with it. This is the top off of it. That thing has got about a million ants in it little black sugar ants that love to bite they don't bite hard but nonetheless they they like to nibble yeah let's go ahead and go get the gas we'll drive up front and we're gonna go look at some more stuff over here see like these little tiny trees look they left some more they've got nice marking on there that's a pretty little tree you know I don't know if everybody knows, but most of this stuff's going to turn to wood, firewood, or fuel wood, whatever you want to call it. Uh, the bigger stuff that uh, is salvageable will turn into lumber and beams and vigas. Vigas are just poles that we put across, uh, kind of put across the tops of the the roof inside the house and stuff. Alright, let's get back up here. Get the bad boy over here and put it in the truck. Sorry I'm bouncing so much. Yeah, it's crank just baby up. That's cat power baby.
as far as we go on this bad boy, we don't have to walk until, you know, a couple hundred thousand feet. <laughs> Here's where I'm going to start cutting again. I'm going to start throwing like that tree there. That one's marked on the back. These two are marked. There's my log truck and my service truck, my little service truck. And they're not the greatest things in the world, but hell, they do the job. Actually, it's got a boom on it. 10,000 pounds. I believe it's a 10 or 12,000. I'm not too sure. But, uh, man, it picks those logs up like nothing. That trailer extends out a little bit further. We haul 33s. 36s, 40s, I believe we could haul up to 50s. That thing is awesome. And maybe I'll get a video later on. There's the other skitter down that way. I have another skitter. We don't got, the guys aren't working today. There's our other skitter. We have another 518 up that way. And see if we can get a video without getting squished over here. Here's all the trees that we've already thrown. These are all about 10 inch in diameter, you know, at, at chest height and stuff. All those small stuff. There's a bunch of them, there's at least. He's all putting them in to where it can pull them straight up towards the landing up that way. Let's see if we can catch him on here without him noticing. <laughs> Sneak up on him, but at a safe distance, of course. He's finding all the little stuff. He's right by the the boundary. Maybe he's seen me, I don't know. He looked at me, he seen me. <laughs> oh, got tangled one of the other trees. There it is. And it just takes that shit off like no problem. Look at that. Pretty. Break the tip. Smash it. Awesome. Well, I better get back to work. <laughs> Going for the next one. It's kind of a hard thing, but. Let's see if he gets this big one. Yeah, he's getting a bigger one.
There it goes. That one's about 14 inches. Well, it has a little bit harder time on the 14 inch than the bigger ones, but. Just gonna get it up a little bit closer to the top, probably. So we're pushing this one all the way over here. There it goes. Let me tell you, these machines are awesome. They go from. Probably from uh, uh, 15 20 minutes per tree by hand. Uh, 15 on the smaller stuff, 10 to 15 minutes. And with these machines, uh, you've seen there a couple, maybe a minute, throw it, drop it, two minutes at the most. And we're supposed to be getting a new machine, and I will make a video when we get that one. Well, you guys have a good day. I hope you enjoyed the video. I know there's a lot of comments.